is now day five, so I figure I should probably explain what happened to day four. I'll do both day four and day five in this one video. Um, I woke up from my campsite on the morning of day four, and my goal that day was to drive around and check out some of these areas I had checked out on the satellite maps. And uh, did some time, uh, spent some time doing that. I actually drove all the way to the end of Hole in the Rock Road. I was just kind of curious uh, what the drive was for the rest of the way out there. And it became a, a significantly more parched landscape once you kind of near, get near the end of Hole in the Rock Road. Um, but ultimately, I really didn't find anything that I felt like shooting um, out in that area. Um, there's some places I plan on going back to in future years on dedicated shooting trips in the side canyons and, and stuff like that. But I felt like I was, I was done there. So it was around 11 o'clock or so in the morning. I was at the end of Hole in the Rock Road. And I decided, you know, I just want to head over to Zion and spend some time over there. It's just such a nice, lush place, which is where I am right now. And uh, so I figured it would be a little bit of an issue because that was a Friday morning. And uh, I knew that the campgrounds would fill up here pretty fast. But I made the drive from the end of Hole in the Rock Road all the way over here to Zion and rolled in here around, I don't know, probably around five o'clock or so. Of course, the campground was full, so I grabbed a hotel room. And I don't usually like um, staying in hotels when I go on trips. It just kind of, uh, I don't know, I mean, it's nice to have a shower. Um, it's nice to have some of the comforts, but you know, I'd much rather just be camping. I get up early that way, otherwise I kind of sleep in if I, uh, if I sleep in a hotel room. But uh, I took a, a very nice long shower and uh, I figured that after, after that was done, I wanted to just get my, my money's worth from the hotel room. So I, I made myself a bubble bath, I will, I will admit to that. And uh, soaked and enjoyed a bubble bath for a while. It's a, it was a very manly bubble bath, so that was, that was, that was good. I actually just emptied all the shampoo containers in there and made some good bubbles. Uh, but I grabbed some food and my plan was to uh, grab a campsite from one of the first come first serve campgrounds in the morning. And so that's what I did this morning. I found my campsite, so back to camping again, which is, which is nice. Um, earlier this morning, I did the hike up to Hidden Canyon. And there's some areas up there that I wanted to check out with the possibility of maybe doing some shooting. And I found some compositions I kind of like. The conditions just aren't quite right. So I'll have to kind of put that on my list for things to return to later down the line when, uh, when the conditions are pretty good for it. Uh, I was also able to test out one of my uh, little projects I wanted to be working on here, which is the, I call it the straight down cam. And what I did is I took my GoPro camera and I mounted it to a monopod that's attached to the side of my backpack. And it sits about four feet above the top of my head looking straight down. And uh, so I think it'll give a very uh, vertigo inducing uh, perspective on some of these hikes where you have these sheer drop offs. Uh, so I, I record some video from the hike into uh, Hidden Canyon. If any of you have hiked that before, you'll know that there's some uh, pretty sure drop-offs um, and uh, you got the chains there to hold on to, but I think that'll be some very interesting video. And then uh, probably on Monday morning, so the day after tomorrow, uh, I want to do that for some sections of Angel's Landing because uh, I think that could be uh, quite the interesting video. So that was one of the projects I wanted to work on here. I'm going to spend the rest of the time uh, scouting around, um, checking out some of my favorite locations, seeing how they look in the spring. I've already found some that are pretty promising, so I might be exposing some film here pretty soon, um, like tomorrow or something. But uh, it's a little warm, but uh, it's quite nice here. And I am by myself in this cool little grove, and I'm really digging it. So I'm going to spend the rest of the day scouting around and seeing what I can find. <laughs> 